you filming? Yeah. <laughs> I, was, I was waiting for a noise from the camera or something. But welcome back to This Is Living, you guys. Like this video, subscribe to my channel. I'm about to go surf a little rocky point. We got a big swell on the way. Our first one of the season looks like it's gonna hit in a few days. Finally, it's gonna be solid. Hopefully the conditions are good. It's not stormy or anything, but yeah, we're gonna go enjoy some fun surf right now out front of my house. Catch a couple waves and trying to figure out which surfboard to ride. We have this 510 squash tail shadow. It is approximately five feet, 10 inches, and that's the only dimensions that are on there. Oh, 29 liter. I don't know, Paisel just decides to not put the width or thickness on my boards anymore. Why, I have no idea. But it works good, but it's an epoxy and it's pretty windy right now. So typically epoxies don't work super well in windy conditions. And I got this 6.0 uh next step round pin which has been working really well but i think the waves need to be a little bit bigger for it and yeah it's crazy i have so much to choose from i used to dream about having a ton of surfboards like this at my house i could just grab whatever surfboard i wanted and now it's real it's pretty crazy manifestation <laughs> I'm serious. Don't laugh at me. I'm not. Dreams to reality, bro. Yeah, dreams to reality. Phew. Phew. Let's go, sir. Fun session, couple barrels. It was a lot choppier and windier than I was expecting it to be. I knew it was gonna be windy, but it was, there was some serious chop. I nose dove like four times. In the beginning of my session, within like 10 minutes, I must have caught like 12 waves. All super shitty. Didn't do a turn, got, got barreled, nothing. Just fell, kicked out, fell, kicked out, fell. It's pretty funny. But then it kind of turned on a little bit, got a couple little barrels, a couple turns on straight up dry reef. This is what the reef looks like out there. It's not sharper in some places. See? Ow. I'm just kidding. It's pretty sharp. Strong feet. So the epoxy toes. wasn't the call? No, the epoxy was okay. It took a moment to get used to. I had to step way back on the tail. If you guys are ever having problems surfing, one minor tip that can always help is your back foot on short boards. You could be standing a little too far out. So if you feel like you have a board that works good sometimes, not all the time, just step back against the pad or just like behind the back fin, the front fins. Step back. Usually makes the board work good. Because that's my problem a lot. I think a board's not working, I'm like, oh I gotta step on the tail. I'll even like stand up off a little bit. So step back, see how it goes. Let me know how it works. If it works for you guys. Sometimes horses suck, but this board's really good, fun. I thought I was gonna destroy it on the reef. It was like this shallow on some waves when I was kicking out, I was like, oh, jump, and then like roll over it. Good times. We got more surf on the way. I'm freezing, I'm gonna go shower. Dun -na, dun -na, dun -na, dun -na. 
Yeah. Well, there's waves. It went pretty bad for a little bit. Swell showed up, and it's not very good. But tomorrow is going to be pumping. So it's like four or five feet right now at Rockies. I'm gonna go out, catch a couple, and then tomorrow should be on. It was raining all morning here. Check out my bananas. Those from baby, but uh, yeah, I got a haircut, shave my face, feel faster, lighter, faster. Let's go, rocky point. find wax at one of the houses. Well, we're back. Another winter here on North Shore. And pipe, there's waves. It's solid. And there's a couple coming through, but it's very wonky, backwashy, difficult, scary looking pipeline. It's like eight to 10 feet, I'd say. And it's like very interesting looking. We need all this sand right here to move. So this tide pool is really good because it means water's coming in, it's gonna help it drain out. Especially if more waves come, like a bigger swell. It'll, get, it'll be gone in like half a day, so. This is good. I'm gonna go try this 6-2 out. Try to get a wave. Start off the season. First, first session back at pipe, November. Okay, I'm gonna go find wax, because I forgot wax. I'll be right Oh, nice. Let's go. Found wax, thank God. See? Take Lona walking down the beach. What's <laughs> up, dude? Come on. This is living now? You're on This is Living. New mascot. Go yeah. I've replaced you. <laughs> He's stronger than me. Okay, I'm well, gonna I'll, go catch a couple. I'll follow you out real quick a little bit. Try, try. Oh, hi, hi. Oh my god, forgot how cold it gets out there. I was freezing, but I found a pretty fun one. Good start, you know? It's a good time. It's a good way to 
kick off the pipeline new year. So it was definitely difficult. I forgot how tough pipe can be when it's just all over the place and choppy and backwashy, but found a couple, it was really fun. And hopefully tomorrow is good or maybe better. Might be a little smaller, but it's okay. If it just cleans up, so we're on. Winter's finally here. Our first pipe swap. It's gonna be a good, good season. I can feel it. Look how beautiful it is. Well, 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 well. Waves are pumping. Pipe is not good. Like we thought it was gonna be today. Koa Smith. Koa Smith. Koa numero two. Numero dos. We're gonna go rip Rocky Point. It's going off. Oh, interview, little interview table. Yeah. Get in there. Koa, tell me about Grey Poupon. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I haven't it. done it in a while. Dude, it's going off. I'm freaking out right now. I think this is the best day of the year. <laughs> so far. So far. I saw you get a barrel at Pipeline yesterday. I did, I got a little barrel. That feel pretty good? Felt good. It was a small wave, but it was good for the day, you know? I had the opposite experience. I was coming out when right on the wave you came in on, it was like, you went on like a <laughs> was like, tiny wave. Do you ever feel like you're in a session and you're stuck? to just get out of there yeah i was just getting snaked by body borders and just like oh my god that's usually how every one of my pipe sessions ends it's like okay i'm done i just yeah. go in on a shitty little one just call it yeah instead of waiting you sit out there for like two hours yeah and then i kept trying to catch waves to go in on and i'd miss them oh, <laughs> just no. like oh my god that's an even worse feeling. Your freak out wow oh my god Job. <laughs> Is it a mistake not wearing a wetsuit? Too early in the season to wear wetsuit. Yeah. I saw your wetsuit yesterday. Uh, I was egg. Maybe that's why I had a baby set. I was vibrating cold out there. Oh, that board broke. Wasn't a very good session. It's kind of not as good as it looked from the beach. Once I got out there, I was just like, oh, the 
current was just ripping, super choppy. Wind was just howling in your face the whole time you were paddling in the current and it was just water, salt water was hitting you in the eyes. It's like, oh, I can't see. And on top of that, I was not surfing well. I was trying my hardest, but just still felt really off for some reason. Just gotta come in, reset, eat something, and then go back out and try to rip. That's the plan. Step back on the tail. Boom! Big frontside turn. And then boom, big backside turn. And then big air. 